the she achiever put together a great event dubbed she connect conference and exhibition the she achiever doing business with each other taking advantage of being a she achiever to enjoy favorable terms of transaction from suppliers business support service providers and customers who are fellow she achievers it was very instrumental in putting together this um, she achievers program to create the opportunity for connection among um women in business um, thank you so much madam can you tell us a bit about yourself and a little bit of a background my name is Ambassador Nancy Sam, the Vice President for ECOWAS Tourism Private Center, the Tourism Ambassador for Miami Dade County, USA, mm -hmm. and the President of the Women in Tourism, Ghana. Today, we are here to put and deliberate together the She Achievers. Mm -hmm. When I say the She Achievers, I'm talking about women that have accomplished, mm -hmm. CEOs, mm -hmm. lawyers, judges, doctors, contractors. These are all women, business women, exporters and importers. Mm -hmm. So these are the women we have put together to come today to have a dialogue. Mm -hmm. She Achievers have been in existence mm -hmm. for the past four years. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have over 500 women and the She Achievers. These women are movers and shakers. Mm -hmm. They are from the top mm -hmm. level, mm -hmm middle level that mm. have been able to have impact in the country mm. and beyond. Mm. When I say the country, Ghana and beyond. These are women who own hotel rooms, over 60 rooms, 100 rooms mm. from the capital of Ghana, beyond the capital, which is the second capital in Kumasi mm. and the third, capital, uh, third biggest city, which is um, Takradi. They are coming all over from the country to meet in Accra. Mm -hmm. Today, on the 2nd of February, mm -hmm. we had it in La Palm Royal Beach mm -hmm. Hotel. Mm -hmm. to, and also, we had some various ambassadors, who also female ambassadors, to come as a motivator to all these women, to motivate them, because mm -hmm. it is not easy to become a, a woman ambassador. You must be a mover and a shaker in your country to be able to be, be selected out mm. of the men mm. to mm. come to another country, foreign country, to represent your country. Mm. So today we had a few ambassadors with us. Mm. We also have CEOs for various countries. Mm. Uh, I mean, not countries aside, but for airlines yes. who yes. are female, okay. especially the airline mm. for Qatar. Wow. You know, our brothers in Qatar, mm. they believe in men more than women. My name is Ambassador Nancy Sam. Listen to Leslie Golding on Nation One. So today, she, con she Achiever She Connect program has been successful in my view because we have a cream of women who have, uh, as it was society, we see them as having achieved, who are in this room. Mm. And each woman is committed. You, know, you listen to all of us and you can, you can feel a sense of commitment by mm. each one of us to actually help the next generation, the next generation, you know, to tell it as it is. There are a few people who have been shared their lives. Mm. This is a way to tell you that there is always a will, a way where there is a will. And how do you get that way, even though you have the will, is to get other people who will say that, look, I'm holding your hands, I'm going along with you. Even when you fall, even when you fail, don't think that is the end of the journey. The important thing is not your fall, but the important thing is you rising up again and then going on that journey with somebody actually going with you. And that is what I believe as you achievers we need to do because the connection between your achievement and what you do for society, it's really the most important. Not just your achievement, mm. but the connection. And I keep you know, emphasizing that mm. because that really helps others to know what they have can do and what they have to do. To, to, I won't say to be like you, but even to be better than you mm. because that is what you always want, a better version of yourself. In other people. From here, there are a number of programs that have been outlined, you know, series of she programs. So, uh, some will be training, she training, she virtual connection, you know, um, she meetings. I mean, there are a number of them, and she mentoring and all that. Each one will be, you know, geared towards 
bringing a group of you know young women, for instance, to try and understand and appreciate and see some of these people that you know you'll be seeing in the room and be able to network with them because networking is the new currency. Mm. You know, mm. networking, your network work is actually your net worth. How much you are worth sure. is how much you can network. Mm. And it is not for wrong reasons, mm. but networking meaning that if you know, you can just shout and mm. somebody can hear you and come to your help. Because as women, wow. we are not super superhuman. Wow. We have so listen to Leslie Golding on N1 TV is Auntie Lucy and I'm the marketing manager for you for you limited we do the sub drink mm. yes and I'm a key achiever oh how would you say this whole program has been for you what has been um, your general impression of it in fact let me tell you today that this is a very impressive uh, program that I wish every woman would come here because from the talks that the past women and those who have gone through a lot of things say today, in fact, I'm so much confident and I say that, in fact, women, we have a long way to go. And women, we are the nation. And women, we can change the world. Oh, so so what one thing would you say or some key highlights of this program you say you are taking from here? Yeah, one key highlight that I've taken today is, in fact, if you want to, be what you want, you can be what you want to be, no matter the challenges, no matter the differences. Because there was a lady, Mousy, who spoke about how she helped or how she became what she went through through a very tough time. Because the father has so many children, but she could not make it to secondary school because the father wanted her to go to a vocational. But because she no want to, she want to be a. She tried at the end being at secondary school, and today she has helped a lot of women. And this has motivated me that if I have two cities, I can spend fifty pesos on somebody. That person can be here and also help somebody, and together we we'll change the world. What would be your advice for the young ones coming up who want? to get into it. In fact, the young ones, what I want to tell the young ones is nothing is too late. Sometimes it's not necessarily going to school or probably being a doctor or anything. You can see handiwork. And me, myself, let me tell you that I was once a contractor, okay. but I started again at Bisa Brick. And in fact, when you taste my drink, you really, really like it. I'm just facing some few challenges, but very soon I'll hit the world. And you know that women, no matter your age, no matter the differences, no matter how financially you are, just start from a, another angle and God will lift you up. Collaborating through mm. connecting with each other, mm supporting and promoting one other's interest in our businesses as much as mm. possible and lastly the need for exposure mm. we need to expose ourselves and ensure that whatever we are doing is brought to light so that we can continue to shine so today at this she connects meeting we are saying to all women achievers, mm. leaders, mm. and CEOs in Ghana that get connected to achieve more. Listen to Golden on N1 TV. It is the best. This is Narelle from Australia. You should listen to Nation One TV and Leslie on Nation One TV. Listen now. In She Connect conference and exhibition, this ends my report. Thank you for watching Nation One TV. Kindly subscribe for more news updates.